So um, today is a reset day, so I'm gonna do something different this time. I'm gonna show you guys like a place I usually come to, to you know, just think. It's just it's like a thinking spot, and I think it's important for all of us to have a thinking spot. Just a place we can go to whenever you know we we want to get out the house, you know, see some beautiful scenery, or just to clear our heads, think clearly, and everything like that. And I'm gonna be showing you guys mine right now. And man, <clears throat> it is so beautiful today. I went smooth. I went to Smoothie King. Got me some. Got me a nice little smoothie. I got my uh, wheat thins with me, and then I got my headphones. So I'ma just chill, eat, and look at the view. I'm I'm dead serious. Like, and I'ma just think, chill. Feel like I need to start doing this every week. I don't do this. Every, I didn't really do it every week. I I came here about like a couple times, but now I I want to actually start incorporating into. I go to it every week. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys this beautiful, beautiful location and uh, let's get to it. Y'all, I just got, just got out of that uh, whole little meeting thing, thing, thing. And I had to do videographer work. And I'm gonna let y'all know now that was really, really good. Like, it was really good. There was so many black owned businesses in there. And a majority of the black owned businesses were, were women. I'm pretty sure all of them were women. Like, they were all black women owned businesses. And it was so amazing to see that. Like, it was so amazing. And I got to talk to some of them, got to see like, you know, uh, what they do. You know what they wanted where they want to take it and everything and they got nothing but big aspirations and goals and all that stuff so it was very awesome to be there and uh i got a lot of great shots um i think the only thing is i got 90 videos to edit bro 90 never in my life have i edited edited 90 videos like that before but i can definitely i can do it i can do it i ain't got no doubt i can definitely I got a shot of everybody's brand, like a shot of every women's brand that was in there. And it was just so great. Everybody was happy. They were showing off their stuff. It was just like a unity of black people just doing great things. And it's like, imagine that on a higher scale. Like, wow, like we can definitely do it guys. But hey, got a special guest here today. This is family, this is blood. This is the boy Floyd. This is my cousin from Florida. He's staying with me for a week. So be on the lookout for a whole lot of stuff we're gonna be doing this week. All right, though, my name is Floyd. I live in Florida. I will be staying here for a couple weeks and stuff like that. But um, I do have my own YouTube channel. Yeah, yeah. Floyd vs. The World Vlogs. Um, follow me on Instagram, Floyd vs. Yeah, yeah. Snapchat, Floyd, the underscore great. But yeah, you're gonna see a lot of things this week. It's been pretty fun so far. Let's get to it. Real reason why I'm kind of starting this vlog off is because I'm about to do something kind of nerve wracking for me right now. I don't know if I, I haven't talked about it much, but I'm in the process of trying to start a production company. It's just me and Tia. It was Zoe too, but stuff happened. We miss you Zoe. Yeah, yeah. Me and Tia, we're starting this thing up. I'm gonna be real with y'all. I don't know much about business at all. Like, especially, I took a business especially, class. man, I'm taking business classes too. Right. They can only do so much. This is something new. This is something different. And especially when it comes to, you know, film and everything like that, it's kind of like a whole different ballpark than what they teach you in school. So it's just a matter of trying to, I don't even know. I'm high key. Look, look, look. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 excuse me. I know this. I don't know. Because literally what I feel like right now, I've walked into a whole nother world that I've never been in before. I don't know 
anything about it. I try to understand it, but it's just like, I don't know, it's just not clicking yet. You know, I just don't know what to do. And right now I'm about to make a step in this new world toward what I'm going after. And it's kind of scary because I feel like if I do make this step, I'm gonna be even deeper in this unknown that I'm kind of in. Things are telling me to just do it anyway. You know, it's kind of like a learning thing along the way. So, but right now I'm about to purchase the domain name for the official website. Y'all will learn about it soon when we get everything up and running, but. <sighs> What's up y'all? So it's uh, 6, 10 in the morning. I was about to um, make a step in a world I did not know that well. And that was buying the domain name for my uh, production company. All right, so basically I, uh, I just did it. I'm looking at it right now and I'm like, wow, I can't believe I, I bought, I bought the domain name for it. And honestly, it's just like, it's just really crazy because of the fact that one, yeah, I'm learning about business. I'm a business marketing major, but I don't know much about it. <laughs> Like, I, I don't. It's something that I am trying to learn. I've been reading books. I've been reading this film marketing book, all this other stuff, just so I can understand the business as much as I can. I don't want to just keep taking in knowledge and not taking any action, because that could take long. And knowing me, I, I would take forever to do that. It's basically the thing about me is sometimes I am scared to try new things, especially when it's things that I don't know that well thing about it is it's like it's like it's scary <laughs> felt like i just walked in a haunt unknown world in front of me are steps toward where i want to go I'm, i feel like each step i take toward what i want is just getting gonna get me more lost because like i said i don't know much about this so but for some reason something just told me to do it I, I don't know what told me to do it, but it, it just told me to do it. I hear I hear people say it's okay if you don't know everything at first because because you know most of the time when we prepare for something, it might not be how we expect it to be, or it's not how everybody says it is. You know, it could be, it could be completely different. So it's completely fine. And from that, you're kind of you're just learning along the way. You know, you might not know where you're going or how it's gonna go, but you have faith that it'll go well. So I'm pretty sure like, hey, that's what kind of got me to do with it. I'm gonna get rid of the shoe. And basically I just, uh, I just said, yeah, let me go ahead and take some action. And whenever it came to this films, this film studio production company thing, I'm always been like, you know, oh, let me make sure I understand this. Oh, let me make sure I understand that. I've been doing that for weeks now, weeks. I'm not trying to rush anything. It's one thing to just talk about something for weeks instead of, you know, actually taking action toward it. And now thinking about it, I think it, I would rather be the type of person to take action and learn along the way rather than try to learn as much as I can and then get get into it when, when I think I understand it. It's like, it's like you gotta find the middle between gaining knowledge and actually taking action. What this production company stands for what it will be and where I want it and the connection I wanted to have with the world and everybody who supports it. I just want it to be a, a, a beautiful, a beautiful thing. Like, honestly, like every time I think about it, I just get so excited because it's like, wow, you know, is it is it even possible to have a connection with people like that? And I just want to try it out. Like, why not? It's like, why not try to add some more positivity into the world, you know? That's why I'm trying to make this, not only because this is like something I dream of doing, but because I feel as though this will have a good impact and I want, that's what I want it to have. I don't want it to be nothing that, that, that is just for me to gain from. I want it to be something that everybody gains from just because of the message it puts out, the, the image it has, and I just want it to be like a beacon of inspiration for everybody. Me making a, a first step toward that, yeah, it was scary, but it felt, it feels right to do now, now that I think about it. All right, so my cousin got me playing this stupid behind game called Rainbow Six Siege. It's not stupid, it's just you're not 
talented yet. Excuse me? Yeah, it's not talented yet. Put some meat on your chest when you're talking to me. You're not talented yet. Yeah, yeah. That's a great battle. You're attacking first. Literally. You know what? <laughs> Trump was shooting at what's his name, Joe. Mm-hmm. It was just like, it was just trifling. Just trifling. <laughs> and I was like reading everyone's comments, like as they're watching it, yeah. and they're just like, what the yeah, yeah. Like this, like as far as presidential debates go, like this by far was the most unprofessional. Oh, most deaf. You was- kidding me? <laughs> Bro, like, like Joe couldn't even get his points out. I Dude know. was trying to talk. He said, just shut up, man. Like I, I was like, bro, that's crazy. We were me and me and my cousin and uh my mom and all that were watching it. We we're like, bro, what is going on? Like I can't believe this is real. I like know. like debates are supposed to be like professional <laughs> and like serious and like all that stuff and it just like wasn't that one part, what was that one part? Where they were like, can you just, de- what was it, denounce the white supremacists? No, he said, um, can you denounce the, uh, wh- yeah, white supremacists? Yeah, white supremacists, yeah. And he was like, uh. So, uh, <laughs> what you, like, what, what do you want me to by. say? He said, stand by. And, uh, what does that mean? That man said, wait for the signal. For real. That's crazy, bro. Goat Tia right here. We haven't, we haven't updated them about Zoe. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Zoe's taking a hiatus, but she will be back. We'll be back soon, so don't worry. Anyway, <laughs> got Cuzzo in the cut. What's up, man? All right, so I think it would be great to have a younger outside view of like what we're doing, just so we can get more ideas. Cause I was thinking, I mean, they the future, you know? So what's catching their attention these days? So, you know what I'm saying? They running TikTok, they running everything now. So it's like, okay, what are some more perspectives we could add to the website, all that stuff, so we can pop more? Cause I'm gonna be real with you. I was looking at this la- this this uh website, I was just like, bro, what do I do? So, yeah. Do you like do you like in and out? I actually had in out today. I do. You do? I used to not like it. Cause I tried it the first time that it like came to Texas, which is back in 2012. And like everybody and their yeah. mom went. The line was like out well the street. into the street. Yeah. So so do you like the fries? No, I don't like the fries. Okay. Like, that, that's Ooh. the reason why. Okay, I, I was like, I was like, ugh. I had the fries the first time and I like did not like it. And so ever since then when I was 12, I was like, I do not like in and out. Mm-hmm. And then you know, my boyfriend likes in and out and he was like, You have to try it, like try it. Like the burger is really means, good. You have to try it. <laughs> <laughs> so as of now, this is the, this is all default. I ain't put in nothing. Okay. I ain't do nothing. All I did was put in the picture. And just like, yeah, that was basically mm-hmm. it. We built studios. Oh yeah, should we have a theme song? No. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking we should like hit up like Beyonce, Rihanna, have them do it. Oh, no. <laughs> Heck no. Boy dropped the tape. No. A song. Yeah, it was a cipher. It was like a love cipher. A love cipher. Yeah. You can freestyle. It was. I, I made like I was no part. Because the other song I made, remember? Can you freestyle? I could. Can you freestyle in that? Yeah, I just thought of some shit. And I just said, all right, it go. Well, well, well. <laughs> he said he could I'm, freestyle I'm to say, you. I only said a line, though. Well, uh, I said, like, let's, two uh, lines. let's see. Let's see what you got. <laughs> I only said two lines, though. It was just like. Floyd, what's your name? What's your rap name? It was YSL. You said YSL? Yeah. You signed? Nope. You will be? All right, cool. <laughs> we like the positivity. But can you can you freestyle for us? I could. You know, T- Tia wants to know uh, what you're all about, and if uh, you're about music, you should uh, express yourself. I don't, I don't think she wants to. <laughs> Thank you. See, you I think, yeah, Tia, you Tia, Tia, don't you don't people. you want to hear more about your fellow Floridian? You got people that want to make music, and you got people that can talk about and, you know music. That's How many songs I'm, have I'm, you made, Floyd? I made two songs. Okay, so uh, it seems like you're pretty. Uh, why, why, why can't you, you just got show your, her song? Huh? I can just show her a song. Yeah. You want to hear a song, song or do you want to yeah. hear a freestyle? No, she can just hear a song. You evil. You evil. She we know what you're doing. Yeah. <laughs> Tia's ears are about to be blessed, y'all. <laughs> you heard 
the sun. Oh, Was you in the studio? Who studio? He said, yeah. You heard? Yeah. <laughs> Are you typing my slogan because it's starting <laughs> to grow on you? I just wanted to see what it looked like. Yeah, wait, wait, wait. What was your slogan? Visual. I will. You will. We will. Studios. Yeah, yeah, that sounds good. Woohoo! Because it makes sense. Because it's We Will Studios, right? It's. It's We Will Studios. We Will Studios. Okay, if you so use I will. No, no, no. Hey, I hey. I want us to be. I want us to be 100% honest I, I just, here. I don't have a better idea. So, what, what am I going to do? <laughs> She said, you lucky I ain't got no <laughs> money. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Like, hold on, how you say house in Spanish? It's La Casa, right? Okay, I, I, I guess. I know, I know, I Good job. All right, all right. We, we, we said this earlier. How you say opinion? Uh, it's a lot of peace. I know that. How you say girl? And there's Nina, multiple right? words it's like Nina. for girl. It's La Chica, mm -hmm. La Nina. Niño, na, niña. Um, Nino is a boy. I know that. These are basic words. So I'm know. saying, I'm trying to think of one. How you say backpack? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Backpack. Yeah, yeah. How you uh, say food? Food. Like food. Food. I don't know, but I know how to say chicken. No, I know how to say French fries. Papa fritas. Yeah. Because I, I was at work one day, and I was like, <laughs> Why she look so hurt? I was like, can you drop some fries? And she said, huh? I said, Papa Fritas. And she's like, oh, see, see, see. She dropped Papa Fritas. Papa Fritas. <laughs> <Papa> Fritas. <laughs> <laughs> good, y'all. Meeting is over. It was pretty good. What you think, bro? It was good. It was great. What'd you think of Tia? She was nice. She, she knew what she was talking about. Exactly. That's why we love Tia. Shout out to Tia. But, yeah, so this man never in his life had in and out Burger before. So, uh... About to get this boy's reaction to that nasty stuff. All right, let's go. All right, y'all, it's time. Let's go. Let's see. Let's we're gonna, see. We're gonna try the burger. Nasty, everybody. <laughs> it's pretty good. Scale one is in. I'm gonna say about the egg. The fries with the shake. It's good. The fries by itself. The fries by itself. I mean, they're fresh. That's great. But, but they don't they don't taste good. They don't hit like that. At all. They don't hit like that. Okay, just making sure. Yeah yeah. Go crazy. If you know you know. E -e 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 -e. Yo, bro. <laughs> Dang, that's crazy. <laughs> oh, he ain't even oh, get his stuff checked. Oh, <laughs> what are we doing? Check your bag in, boy. <laughs> we tripping. Okay. I was official. All right, man. <laughs> you stay up, sir. <laughs> Good. <laughs> All right, cuz. All right, cuz. Stay up. Yeah, my heart is bleeding. You know, at that post when I was young, young nigga, I started bleeding. I'm wolfing that child with no blanket, that shit was freezing. Got a demon in my eyes, spin the block and leave on leaking. Demon in my eyes, I spin the block and leave on leaking. Gotta sit back. Sippin' that potion, that 40 on token Run up on me, I'm gonna blow it That gas on Oak 